Welcome to the lecture series in radiation physics. Radiation sources of heavy charged particles. The main source of alpha particles is alpha decay. In the decay process, a parent nucleus X is converted to a daughter nucleus Y and an alpha particle is emitted. Alpha decay is fundamentally a quantum tunneling process. The alpha particles appear in one or more energy groups that are monoenergetic. The decay process is characterized by a fixed energy difference or Q value, which is also called as the disintegration energy. This Q value is shared between the recoil nucleus and the alpha particle. So that each alpha particle appears with the same energy given by Q into A minus 4 by A, where A is the mass number of the parent nucleus. Most alpha particle energies are limited to between about 4 to 6 mega electron volt. Because alpha particles lose energy rapidly in materials, alpha particle sources are prepared in very thin layers. Some of the common radioactive sources of alpha particles and their properties are shown. Spontaneous fission. Fission process is the only spontaneous source of energetic heavy charged particles with mass greater than that of alpha particle. All heavy nuclei are unstable against spontaneous fission into two lighter fragments. Spontaneous decay is usually accompanied by the emission of neutrons. The most widely used example is Californium-252. In CF-252, the probability of alpha emission is higher than that of spontaneous fission. Now this graph shows the mass distribution of fission fragments of Californium-252 and Uranium-235. As you can see, the fission is predominantly asymmetric so that the fragments are clustered into two groups. In the case of Californium-252, the fragments are clustered into light groups with mass number 108 and a heavy group with mass number 143. This figure shows the distribution in kinetic energy of Californium-252 fission fragments. The energy shared by the two fragments averages about 185 mega electron volt. The distribution of energy is also asymmetric with the light fragment receiving the greater fraction. <laughs> 